Hello, this is not your chem tutor, and in this video, I will teach you how to solve the mass percent composition of elements in a compound. I also included three examples for practice. Let's proceed to the formula. Mass percent of an element is equal to N times atomic weight of element divided by molar mass of compound times 100. N stands for the number of atoms of a particular element in a compound. The atomic weight of the element, you can find that in the periodic table. Plus, you should also know how to compute the molar mass of a compound. If you still do not know how to compute the molar mass, please check the description box. I will put there the link to my video. Let's answer example one. What is the mass percent of sulfur in sulfuric acid? The chemical formula is H2SO4. The first thing we need to do is to compute the molar mass of the compound. And the given compound is H2SO4. It is composed of three elements, hydrogen, sulfur, and oxygen. So you have two hydrogens. 1 sulfur, and 4 oxygen atoms. You multiply the atomic weight of hydrogen, 1.008, for sulfur, 32.07, and for oxygen, 16 grams per mole. For hydrogen, this is equal to 2.0. 016 for sulfur 32.07 and for oxygen 64 grams per mole and if you total this is equal to 98.0018 grams per mole. So this is the molar mass of sulfuric acid. Now, let's use the formula for mass percent. And we are looking for the mass percent of sulfur. So mass percent of sulfur is equal to N. N is the number of sulfur atoms in sulfuric acid. So that is 1 times the atomic weight of the element. The atomic weight of sulfur is 32.07 grams per mole divided by the molar mass of the compound, which we computed earlier, 98.086 grams per mole times 100. So grams per mole will cancel. We have 1 times 32.07 divided by 98.086 times 100. This is equal to 32.7%. And this is the mass percent of sulfur in sulfuric acid. Example 2, what is the mass percent of carbon in acetic acid? The chemical formula is CH3COOH. So let's solve first the molar mass of acetic acid. It is composed of three elements, carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. So there are two carbon atoms, three plus one, so four hydrogens, and two oxygen atoms. Then we multiply the atomic weight for carbon 12.01 grams per mole, for hydrogen 1.008, and for oxygen 16 grams per mole. So this is equal to 24.02. Four point zero three two and thirty two grams per mole. And if you get the total, 
this is equal to 60.052 grams per mole. Then we use the formula for the mass percent, and we are looking for the mass percent of carbon. So mass percent of carbon is equal to N. So N is the number of carbons in acetic acid, so that's 2 times the atomic weight of carbon, which is 12.01 grams per mole, divided by the molar mass of acetic acid, 60.052 grams per mole times 100. So grams per mole will cancel. We have 2 times 12.01 divided by 60.052 times 100. And this is approximately equal to 40.0%. So this is the mass percent of carbon in acetic acid. Our last example is example 3. What is the mass percent of each element in aluminum sulfate? The chemical formula is Al2SO43. So let's solve first the molar mass of aluminum sulfate. Let's count the number of atoms of each element. So for aluminum, we have 2. For sulfur, that's 1 times 3, so 3. And for oxygen, that's 4 times 3, so 12. Then we multiply the number of atoms to the atomic weight. This is equal to 53.96 for aluminum. For sulfur, 96.21. And for oxygen, 192 grams per mole. And you get the total. This is equal to 342.17 grams per mole. So this is the molar mass of aluminum sulfate. The problem is asking for the mass percent of each element. So we will get the mass percent of aluminum, mass percent of sulfur, and mass percent of oxygen. Let's start with the mass percent of aluminum. So we will use this formula. So the number of aluminum atoms in aluminum sulfate is 2 times the atomic weight of aluminum. 26.98 grams per mole divided by the molar mass of the compound 342.17 times 100. For mass percent of sulfur, this is equal to 3 times the atomic weight of sulfur 32.07 grams per mole divided by 342.17 grams per mole times 100. And for mass percent of oxygen, this is equal to 12 times 16 grams per mole divided by 342.17 grams per mole times 100. For mass percent of aluminum, if you solve this in your calculator, this is equal to 15.8%. For mass percent of sulfur, this is equal to 28.1%. And for oxygen, this is equal to 56.1%. So these are the answers to your question. 15.8% aluminum, 28.1% sulfur, and 56.1% oxygen.